Hey everybody, Desert Guardian here, and today I want to talk to you about Cobra Kydex gear. Uh, Cobra Kydex is out of Chester, Georgia. Uh, they are a made in the USA, uh, small Kydex slash thermoplastic uh, company. They make wallets, they make holsters. Um, the wallet is here, the holster is here. This is an inside the waistband right hand holster, but we'll cover that in a minute because there's lots of different options on that one. And then of course we've got the wallets, which also have a few different options. And we're gonna start with that. So first thing you notice from Cobra Kydex is this nice presentation box that they send their gear in. Um, Compact, lightweight, durable, love it. Made in the USA. Like I said, they're right out of Chester, Georgia. This is a made in the USA company. Uh, would like to support those uh, American makers. And on the side, cobrakydexgear.com is their website. I'm gonna put that website down below uh, so you can go check out their gear. But this is one of their thermoplastic Kydex wallets. Uh, flip it over on the back. And you see it's got option boxes that they check off. This is the seven to nine card, which is the medium size. It does have the RFID blocking in it and uh, it has a steel money clip in black. So let's go ahead, see what's inside the box. We know what the options are. It's a nice little presentation box here. And this is the Cobra Kydex wallet. So um, as you can see, it's all Kydex. It's got more, it's got a a pressure compression system to hold your cards in here and of course the steel money clip on the back so we'll go ahead and slide their business card out there so you can see the money clip you can start there is a dual compression style so you can slide your bills in and it'll actually stop right there you got to give it that extra nudge to get all the way in um, nice tight money clip on there it is steel it's not going anywhere um, great way to secure your bills so this is an option so you don't have to get the money clip if you're just looking for a card holder and like i said before this is kind of a front pocket wallet not a back pocket wallet so it's nice and small it's not that much bigger than your driver's license or a credit card and we can compare that to you know the billfold that i think we're all used to using they're big they're thick um you know the pockets in it you know one two three four there's there's nine card pockets in here and this is a, a seven to nine card uh, wallet right here so it's thinner it's smaller in every dimension um, so like I said front pocket wallet nice incognito very lightweight we'll set this old dinosaur aside and uh, I've got a uh, bunch of old Starbucks gift cards and old credit cards and stuff and I'll go ahead and put those in here so they're easy to slide in you see they fit in there perfectly this is gonna be the size of a credit card, driver's license, um, the all the stuff that you carry around with you in your giant billfold wallet. Um, I think I put five or six in there. So this is a seven to nine size. So you can see it more can fit in there. And the pressure from the folded thermoplastic Kydex is what holds them in place. So I'm not squeezing, I'm trying to, trying to hold it loosely so you can see these things aren't gonna fall out of here. But if you want something, just grab it with your thumb right here in the corner and it'll slide right out. So very easy to use, very easy to load. And like I said, the pressure holds everything in place. It's not just gonna come flying out in your pocket or in your car. Uh, front pocket, heck, you can put it in your back pocket. You can put it in the cup holder of your car. It's that convenient, that small. I uh, got the nice little lasered logo here. So yeah, that's it. That's the Cobra Kydex gear wallet. Uh, all the sides and edges are nicely uh, smoothed out. There's no sharp edges on this, so it is gonna be comfortable in your pocket. Um, and like I said, this one does have the RFID blocking. So if you've got a military ID or even uh, one of those credit cards that has the chip in it uh, or anything that's got an RFID, this is going to protect it from being you know, monitored or snooped on by one of those uh, electronic devices that uh, that may or may not be able to uh, pick up on the information on your card. So it's got that RFID blocking, so that is nice and secure. Love that option. So yeah, so there's the uh, the Cobra Kydex wallet. Um, nice setup. I'm looking forward to putting my real stuff in there and some bills on the back and give this a carry for a couple weeks and report back on it. So. Uh, there it is, let's set that guy aside. And let's take a look at their inside the waistband holster. So once again, nice presentation box, Kydex, uh, Cobra Kydex's information on the side, and the options on the back. So 
This is an inside the waistband holster. It says so right there. Um, this is an ambidextrous setup, but it's set for right hand. I'll show you that on the holster once I get it out. Uh, this is a Glock 17, 19, 22, 23. Uh, it does have the optic cut, and it is the one and a half tough, one and a half inch tough clip on it. So let's pop this guy open and see what's in here. There we go. Oh, that's nice. So the first thing I noticed is this guy came out. So what this is, this is a second, uh, they, I, I'm not sure what it's called, but it's like a belt wing. What this does is when it's inside your pants and your belt's going through here, it actually puts extra pressure on this little piece right here and pushes the grip of the firearm closer to your body so less printing. And look at that. It comes with two different sizes. So try this one out. If I don't feel like it's in far enough, I can put a little bit bigger one on. So that's awesome. It comes with, uh, comes with both of them. So let's take a look at the holster. So the first option on the back was it is ambidextrous. Well, how can it be a right hand holster and be ambidextrous? Well, check it out, flip it over. You can run this to the, you can run a, uh, a clip on the other side. If I wake up one day and find that I'm left handed, I can move the clip to the other side and there I have a left handed holster. So save time, save money. Um, they're able to make an ambidextrous setup, but this particular one is set up for right hand. Uh, it has the, the tough clip on it, which is going to be uh, like an ABS plastic clip, a nice hook on it for inside the waistband carry. It does have two rubber grommets in here so you can adjust the tension. I haven't adjusted this one, so hopefully I don't send a gun flying when I shake it and test the, uh, the retention on it. Um, but yeah, and this one's set up for an optic cut. It has a, a, a deeper ridge on top for co-witness sights. Uh, so let's see, I've got my... Glock 17 right over here. So here's my Gen 3 17. Um, nine millimeter, you know, just kind of your basic everyday 17. Slides right in, not squeezing it, but it does have uh, good retention right from the jump. You can tighten it up if you need to. So yeah, that's, that's a clean, sleek, inside the waistband holster. Now, see this bump right here? It's an interesting option you have on here. This is a Gen 3. Let me grab my 19X. Make sure we're clear here. The 19X is a Gen 5, so it has the ambidextrous slide release on it. That's what this channel's for. So, works perfect with a Gen 3. You can also put a Gen 5 in it. Now, there are some holsters out here that don't have this bump for a Gen 5. And what happens is as it slides in, it pushes out a little bit like that and it messes with the retention of the wallet or the, the uh, holster. So um, that's a great option to have. So you, you're talking about Gen 1 through Gen 5. All the Glocks are going to work just fine in this and you won't have to worry about it pushing up on the holster like that and, and messing with the, uh, the retention. You won't have to crank it down just to get it to sit in there. Um, let's see. So over here, I've also got my Gen 4 19 and it's got the APLC on it. So let me take that off because this holster is not a light bearing holster. Bear with me here. It wasn't prepared on this one. There we go. But what this does have is it has an RMR and it has suppressor height sights on it. So um, this holster is set up to accommodate both of those. As you can see, suppressor height sights work perfectly fine in this channel. RMR works fine. They call this the optic cut one. So if you're running a you know, Vortex or a Hollow Sun or something that's a little bit different size, it's gonna work with all of them. So yeah, that's it, the Cobra Kydex. Uh, inside the waistband holster. Um, you know what, check out their website. I'm gonna put links below to their website uh, because this holster, you can get many different options, many different colors inside the waistband, outside the waistband. Um, you know, different clips, different styles. You can get a, a higher sweat guard, a lower sweat guard, no optic cut or optic cut, uh, and a bunch of different pistols it will fit also. So, you know, definitely check them out. They. Uh, they, they don't have a, a super huge lead time on it, but if you're doing something custom, obviously they're gonna, it's gonna take a little time to get done. 
love that it has the uh, optional size wing in the box. So yeah, that's it. That's the Cobra Kydex inside the waistband right hand holster. So I'm looking forward to trying this one out for a couple weeks and reporting back. Uh, I've got the wallet here, got the holster, and um, yeah, I'm gonna put them into my daily carry routine, and then I'll do a second video uh, with some updates and some some impressions of the actual use. So uh, that's it. Just wanted to show these off. Like I said, I'm gonna put links below to Cobra Kydex gear, so you can check them out. Uh, look at see if they have a great option for you for your carry. Um, but yeah, got the wallet. Got the holster, I'm gonna put them into my carry rotation. Hope you guys enjoyed this. If you guys have any questions, comments, concerns, please leave them below. I'll get back to you when I can. Um, but yeah, check it out, cobrakydexgear.com. Thank you guys for sending these out and let me try them out and report back to you. Uh, that's it for now. Desert Guardian, out.